Today let's look at a percent word problem. Here in this example it says what is 30% of 7 hours. There are 4 options. Option A 1 hour and 8 minutes, B 1 hour and 15 minutes, C 2 hours and 6 minutes and D 2 hours and 25 minutes. If you think you know the answer go ahead and put the answer in the comment section because I am going to solve this problem now. In order to solve any math word problem, you need to rewrite the word problem using only math symbols. So that's what I am going to do right now. I am going to rewrite this word problem using only math symbols. So I am going to start from the left and go to the right. The first word of this word problem is what. So I am going to rewrite this word using math symbol. This is what we are going to solve and since we don't know what this is yet, which we need to find out, we can call it anything we want. And the common letter we use for something that we don't know is x. So I'm gonna put x here. So now we can keep moving to the right. The next word is is. And if you look at the chart at the bottom right corner of the screen, the mathematical symbol for the word is is the equal sign. So instead of writing is, I'm going to write an equal sign. If we keep moving to the right, the next two words are 30% of. And if you look at the chart, the mathematical symbol for the word of is the multiplication symbol, which is x or the dot. So instead of writing 30% of, I'm going to write 30% multiply. The last two words are 7 hours. Now, if we look at the answers, we can see all the answers are in hours and minutes. So it's good if we get our answer in minutes because then we can easily convert it to hours and minutes later. We know 1 hour equals to 60 minutes. So for 7 hours we have to multiply this by 7. 60 times 7 is 420. So instead of 7 hours I am going to write 420. Now we have rewrote the word problem into a math equation. x equals 30 percent times 420. So now the only thing that we need to do is solve for x. Alright, let's solve this equation. We know 30% can be written as 30 over 100 times 420. If you notice these two zeros cancel out. So 3 times 42 is 126 and we already know this is in minutes. Now we have to convert this into hours and minutes. We know 60 minutes is an hour. So 120 minutes is 2 hours. And the remaining is 126 minus 120 which equals 6 minutes. So we can see option C is the correct answer. I really hope you are finding my tutorials helpful. So until my next video, I will see you later.